Number 1 While preparing for an overnight on top of a mountain in Swedish Lapland, YouTuber Vahid Kulsberg and his husky feared for their lives when they encountered a very young and curious bear. Here, Vahid seems to be enjoying the stunning view when Riley, his dog, spots something unknown moving in the tree line down below. The man acts quickly and proceeds to tie Riley to a leash to prevent her from running after the potentially dangerous animal. After getting a closer look, Vahid confirms that what Riley spotted is, in fact, a bear, and tries to get a clean shot of the beast with his camera. I think I saw a bear. There are some birds in distress over there. I just saw an animal move. A few stressful minutes later, the camera finally catches the bear, unfortunately moving towards the mountain on which the unarmed man and his dog are currently settled. There. It's coming here. Trying to make his presence known, Vahid repeatedly screams at the beast. This only seems to make the animal more curious as it then begins rushing towards the noise and eventually reaches the bottom of the mountain. It's coming here. Hey! Hey! Go back, Harry Flon! Don't come here. Nay! Nay! Come into it! Come into it! Nay! 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 Out of pure self-defense for his and Riley's lives, Vahid throws a few of the largest rocks he can find down the hill in order to, at the very least, scare the dangerous beast away. Nay, 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 nay. Robot, robot, come into here. Robot, Harry, throw. Ah! Ah! None of the rocks hit the target, but thankfully it still seems to work as the bear gives up on his hopes for dinner and runs back into the woods. Vahid and his dog are truly lucky to have escaped from this situation completely unharmed. What would you have done? Would you have run away with your dog, or stood your ground like Vahid did? Number 2 on an organized tour of Glacier National Park in Montana, a group of innocent tourists came way too close to a huge grizzly bear trying to mind its own business. After spotting it, a small portion of the crowd attempts to get closer in order to grab a few nice pictures of this majestic, but also very lethal animal. Suddenly, the beast begins running towards the tourists. Fearing for their lives, they quickly get out of its way and get back with the main group. He's running. Get out of the way. He's running. Yeah, he just wants to get through. The thankfully present park ranger takes on her duty to protect the tourists and starts yelling at the bear. He's going that way. Surprisingly uninterested with potential weeks worth of food right next to it, the beast decides to mind its own business and to continue on its path. I hope those people realize how lucky they were that that grizzly bear wasn't due for a meal and didn't feel threatened. They should all be very thankful to still be alive and in one piece. Number 3 while on a peaceful hike of Kings Canyon National Park, 
YouTuber Norwegian Explorer had an intense standoff with a very menacing bear that could have ended very badly. When arriving on scene, the man realized that the bear was watching a nearby couple as they were packing up their camping gear. It probably smelled their food from a mile away and decided to come take a look for itself. Go away, bear. Go away. Go away. Go away. You can't stay here. After a few tense minutes, the beast attempts a terrifying bluff charge to scare him away. Unfortunately, the man doesn't really get the message and continues to stand his ground against this extremely dangerous animal. Go away. The other way. Go away. Go. 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 Turn around. Turn around. The bear doesn't seem interested in leaving the scene as it's obviously smelling something that's making its stomach growl. After another few minutes of standoff, the beast bluff charges the man again. Finally feeling threatened, both the man and one of the nearby campers start yelling like angry animals to try to scare the bear away. Clearly, this seems to work as it quickly turns away to run back into the woods, leaving behind a potentially delicious meal. Oh, he's coming. Hopefully, those campers thanked the man for putting his life in danger to help them. What would you have done in his shoes? Would you have risked your life to help those campers, or completely ignored them and run away? Thanks for watching to the end. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. See you in the next one.